In 2022, Sri Lanka was facing its worst economic crisis since independence. A shortage of foreign currency reserve required to import fuel leads to severe fuel shortage. Citizens endure long queues, sometimes up to five days, to purchase 20 litres of fuel. This brought the country almost to a standstill, impacting productivity, the economy, children's education. ICTA handles the digital transformation journey of Sri Lanka. We wanted to ensure equitable and efficient allocation of fuel to minimize hoarding and black market activities. The Ministry of Power and Energy, along with ICTA, worked with two partners, MIT and Dialog Garciata, to develop and implement a QR code-based national fuel pass in just three weeks. There were two types of challenges, technical and operational. The key technical challenge was high traffic, overwhelming demand from millions of citizens attempting to register simultaneously in national fuel pass. So we used AWS cloud services to ensure scalability and high availability of the platform. DPI described the foundational digital capabilities a nation provides to facilitate efficient and secure digital interaction within a society. The provision of DPI reduced the repetitive development, implementation and operation of common capabilities while increasing digital inclusion and creating opportunities for innovation across all sectors. The Fuel Pass leveraged the existing digital public infrastructure. The Lanka Interoperability Exchange served as a data exchange platform integrating various government services including APIs from Department of Motor Traffic. So when citizens registered vehicles, the Fuel Pass validated this information through leaks Leaks help to streamline data exchange, making national fuel pass system robust and reliable. AWS helped us to be reliable as well. It ensured 24-7 availability of the platform. We didn't have to worry about the speed of deployment. We rapidly deployed and rolled out our system in the critical time frame. Most importantly, AWS helped us to be secure provided robust security features to protect sensitive citizen and vehicle data. There were 1 million registrations on the first day of National Fuel Pass and totaling of 6.5 million registrations overall. Within a month, 93% of fuel stations across the country had adapted the platform, facilitating over 11 million transactions. The impact of National Fuel Pass was immediate and profound. Within a week of its implementation, the long queues were eliminated down to less than five minutes. This boosted productivity as well as citizen satisfaction by providing citizens with weekly fuel quota accessible through a unique QR code. We also curtailed the unnecessary fraudulent fuel consumption, enabling government to reduce fuel imports from 500 million to 240 million US dollars. Once the fuel shortage lessened, the rationing was ended and the national fuel pass was wound down around 13 months after its launch. This was another reason why our choice of AWS clouds was a good one. You can spin up and down as needed without having to provision our own infrastructure. By eliminating the fuel queues, saving millions of dollars and ensuring fair distribution of fuel to the nation, the successful implementation of the National Fuel Pass system stands as a testament to the power of digital public infrastructure in the times of crisis.